Mr. P. Hi. Rajashekaran. Hi. Uh, he is the Chief uh, Product Officer of Bahawan Cybertech. So, sir, could you tell me about your presentation tomorrow and give us insights what the presentation is about? Thanks. Uh, uh, it's, a, it's a great opportunity from InnoMetro for us to participate in uh, the, this event. And uh, I represent uh, Bhavan Cybertech, uh, IT product and global IT product and services organization. And uh, we are going to talk about how technology and innovation is evolving in the metro segment, uh, especially in the areas of uh, payment systems, uh, in, in AML, in decision science, and in uh, common asset management platform, and, and the way data comes together to help the CXOs, the directors, the department heads, the HODs in making quick decisions and predictive decisions. So my topic is primarily revolving around uh, how uh, innovation and uh, digitalization is going to help metros and the learning that we have working with multiple partners globally. So my next question is, what is the latest smart technology that Cybertech has introduced and is being implemented in the Indian railways and metro sector? That's a great question. Uh, primarily, we had helped uh, create a common asset management platform from multiple package vendors' data. Right. So today, when metros are going to be operated for close to around 25 years, it requires uh, data that comes from the planning stage onwards, and then it needs to be preserved as a knowledge base for people to continue to optimally maintain and run those metro rail systems. So we work quite early in the cycle at the time of conception. And today we are partnered with uh, Mumbai Metro Line 3. We are partnered with uh, uh, Alstom uh, uh, in uh, UPMRCL. And we are talking to a few more metros. And we are partnered with the NCRTC in NCR region for providing a, a ticketing mobile app. And globally, we have worked with uh, uh, RTA, Rail Transport Authority in Dubai, with Qatar Rail. And so we bring in expertise of how technology can help decision makers. Um, so my next question is, how cyber techs and uh, projects and environmental sustainability has gone so far? And uh, like how are they uh, enhancing the pas passenger experience? Uh, so could you elaborate on that? OK. In fact, uh, as part of our offering uh, on the digital application side, uh, we have a customer experience platform called DropThought that we have implemented globally. It's a US-based platform that we had created ourselves, and we today are used it in multiple industries, and we are proposing that for Metro as well, for giving a seamless experience like uh, uh, anytime interaction, chatbot, avatar-based interactions, multi-language interactions, and uh, call center management for taking real-time customer feedback and quick response so that customer experiences are enhanced, right? Not just at the station, but then the entire life cycle of a metro. So my last query would be, what is your experience of Eno Metro 2024, fourth edition? OK, uh, what we find uh, from Eno Metro is uh, it, it has been very good in bringing in people across wide variety, right? So we have participants right from Cochin all the way, uh, right, till Haryana, Punjab, and from the east to west and north to south, right? So a diverse audience and a global audience is present. And also, there is good amount of interaction between the OEMs, the vendors, and the solution providers like us. So it is a great platform to collaborate, network, learn from each other, and offer probably the best to our country. So any special message for uh, for us uh, and also you know Metro 2024 from your side? Oh, no, it's, it's a great going, but for the weather, weather has not been kind. Otherwise, uh, I think uh, it's, it's a great event. Uh, I, I think uh, good sort of host. Uh, in fact, I talked to uh, Mr. Narendra Shah as well. We find that uh, the event has been very good. And uh, one suggestion I had given him is to do more closed room workshops, right? Workshops which, which we call as focus workshops on specific topics get those experts and then share it to the industry. Because uh, that's where media organizations and peop uh, people like Metro Rail News or uh, the concept of Inner Metro is share best practices and uh, get global expertise into local and local experience which can be globalized.
I think uh, InnoMetro is one platform that is enabling that for Metro Rail in India. Thank you, sir. Jai Hind.